Stampers and thanks for joining me today. Today we are going to be working with a brand new Stampin' Up! Hostess set called Because I Care. Can you see this sparkle and shine? Oh my gosh, I love this. So beautiful, elegant, and easy and it makes it so worth being the hostess. Whether it's a stamp club or you're just placing a $150 order for yourself or amongst friends, you are going to want this set. Oh, everything is beautiful with it. Let's get started. So this is the hydrangea and the words that come with the Because I Care stamp set. I'll be using the clear mount version today. I've already clear mounted them on their block. And I'll be using two new colors from Stampin' Up! Pacific Point and Wild Wasabi Stampin' Right Markers. And I'll be coloring this right on the stamp. And the stamp was made to naturally shade. It's just amazing. Wild Wasabi on the leaves. Taking some Whisper White cardstock. Now, if this has started to dry on the rubber before you go to stamp it, just take your breath and huff on it to reactivate the color. I call that the Darth Vader effect. Stamp that right on the right hand side. Love the clear mount version. You can see right through it. Oh, isn't it awesome? Love it! Okay, next we're going to take our two-way glue pen. Now, if this is the first time you're using the glue pen, you're going to need to prime it by, by doing this a couple of times to get the glue to come out. This isn't the first time I'm using it, and you don't want big globs here, just tiny little dabs in the center of the hydrangea petals. Less is more here for this particular effect. I'm going to bring in a powder pal tray, take some Dazzling Diamonds glitter, shake off the excess, flick off the excess, and oh my, look at that! Oh, love it! Makes everything sparkly. Powder pal tray, just siphon the excess right back into the jar and it lasts forever. Now for the next step, I pre-cut a top note die from the Stampin' Up! Top Note die in the Big Shot. And we will be using the brand new vintage wallpaper texture folder from Stampin' Up! This is gorgeous. Open that up and stick this half a top note in inside the folder. We've got our Big Shot machine. Gonna slide the multi-purpose platform on tab one. Put that folder in between two cutting pads and just crank it through the Big Shot. And then when you open up your folder, oh, is that amazing? Love it. Okay, so next I am going to lightly attach this to the white layer so I can trim off the top and bottom of the top note. But I'm not putting snail on the edges yet because I still want to attach ribbon underneath them. So put that right up against the edge. And then I'm taking my favorite craft and rubber scissors and just trimming that off so it looks like this. And then we'll take, I'm taking some white organza ribbon, put a little snail on it, and then I'll tuck this under. And then I'll put some snail underneath here. And then I'm gonna, just going to take a little short piece of organza and we're going to tie a little faux bow. Just by tying that around there. Lovely! Attach it to the Pacific Point card base with some snail. And now we just need our greeting. So some Pacific Point... Pacific Point Ink, our thank you stamp, white cardstock scrap, scallop circle punch. Punch that right out. Two dimensionals on the back of that to make it pop. And we'll just put that down in the bottom right hand corner and voila. And our card is complete. Is that awesome? Love it! Sparkly! Thanks for joining me today.